Hi, my name is Sharon Mercurio. I'm the Council on Aging Director for the Town of Acton. I've been here for almost 12 years now. Um, the Senior Center is located at the Human Service Building on 30 Sudbury Road in Acton. Um, what we do is we provide services and programming for our older adults in town. So anybody 60 and older is considered a, a senior. You're welcome to come use our facilities. Um, the majority of our programs and classes are free of charge, thanks to our supportive friends group. Um, so we offer educational programs, health and wellness, um, got a lot of fitness classes. We actually have an exercise gym that's free for you to use. Um, and along with the, the educational component, we, um, it's a great opportunity for people to socialize. And so often people walk through our front door and end up meeting somebody that maybe they worked with 30 years ago or their kids grew up together. Um, so it's a nice way for people to reconnect to each other. And I think after the pandemic, we all really need to reconnect with people. Um, we serve lunch here every day. Um, our hours are Monday from 8 to 5, Tuesday from 8 to 7.30, Wednesday and Thursday 8 to 5, and Friday from 8 to 12. Um, and the reason we've switched our hours over the past few years is try to accommodate folks that are still working. Um, we know if you're just turning 60, chances are you are still working. So take advantage of the evening programs that we have. Um, along with the socialization and education uh, component, we also offer social services for um, the folks in town. And I'll have our senior service coordinator speak in a few moments about the different services that she offers. But um, I think for a lot of folks, walking through the front door is the hardest thing. Once you're here, you'll see that you belong here. There's lots to do. and. Why did it take you so, so long to come down? Um, we are having our open house on Tuesday, September 27th. So it's a great time to kind of get your foot through the door, um, see what we have to offer, meet some folks. Um, we're gonna have some great door prizes. So um, we'll see you then. If you need to get in touch with me, our number here is 978-929-6652. My direct email is smercurio and that's M-E-R-C-U-R-I-O at actonma.gov. Thank you. Hi, my name is Laura Ducham, and I'm the Community Services Coordinator for the Town of Acton. My role within the town is to provide assistance to residents under the age of 60 in the areas of housing, health insurance, childcare, and other financial needs that may come up. My office is located here in the Human Services Building inside the nursing department. Currently, we are working on programs to assist families with childcare who are returning back to work after the COVID pandemic. There are also other local grants available and I encourage people to contact my office by calling 978-929-6651. Hi, my name is James McRae. I'm the Veteran Service Officer for Acton and Boxborough. My whole job is to help residents in town, veterans, surviving spouses with state and federal benefits. Some of these benefits may include assistance for um, people who are hurting financially, or need uh, uh, different resources uh, for medical assistance. Um, I also help people submit claims for service-connected disabilities. Any, any injury or ailment you believe was a direct result of military service, I can help with, assist with that as well. Um, I guess essentially what I, what I would recommend is any residents out there who um, are curious about benefits, at the very least, I'd reach out to my office and we can give you an overview of benefits so that you know what's available to you. You can reach my office at 978-929-6614. Also email me at jmacrae, that's J-M-A-C-R-A-E at actonma.gov. Hi, my name's Kathy Flannery. I'm the clinical manager with the Acton Nursing Service. And we are a uh, VNA or a Medicare certified home health agency. Um, that provides home care to Acton and the surrounding communities. That includes nursing, physical therapy, occupational therapy, um, along with home health aides. And um, we come in with a doctor's referral, whether you've been in the hospital or rehab, um, and we come in and, and get you back to uh, 100%, hopefully. <laughs> um, other services that the nursing service provides um, 
are we offer balance classes with our physical therapy staff and they go through exercises to help um, maintain your balance and to prevent falls um, in the home and we also have podiatry clinics which is provided by a nurse from foot care focus to take care of your uh, feet and we also offer horticultural therapy with kathy fochman um, and she comes in a few times a month and does wonderful floral arrangements and let's see we also have wellness clinics uh, with jill salomon who's our public health nurse and she can check your blood pressure and you can come in with any questions you may have about your health and she can answer them or send you um, in the right direction to get answers to your questions. And um, right now we are gearing up for our flu clinics to provide the flu vaccine. So stay tuned for that. Um, and for contact information for us, you can reach us at 978-929-6650 and feel free to give us a call um, with any questions you may have. Hi, I'm Beverly Hutchins and I work at the Acton Senior Center and I'm the Senior Services Coordinator. I help with outreach and different aspects of things that people may need help with or make connections to such as fuel assistance. I can help with seeing if you can qualify. We can do applications. We can then send them in from here. We have food assistance, which is SNAP if you qualify. If not, we also have things that we can help with with frozen meals, anytime you're in need or any help you may need at home with not being able to cook, etc. Um, some of the other things we can go over is the state home care program, which is Minuteman Senior Services. We do things such as um, they help and have case managers. We connect you with them. They can do an eval in the home for personal care, groceries, shopping, any type of services that would help an elderly stay in the home that needs some slight assistance. The other things that I try to connect and help people with is private home care agencies, skilled nursing, how you go about reaching out to your doctor if there's a need for skilled therapy, skilled nursing, under your insurance. We also do have a SHINE counselor here at the Senior Center. That helps with Medicare, counseling and different things that you do and should check each year on your health insurance because prescriptions can change um, and we can have our shine counselor work with you so any of these programs anything you might have that's not even mentioned on this if you want to call me beverly at 978-929-6652 we can arrange either on the phone or we can arrange in person or if you can't get out, I can make a home visit if needed. I'm John Day. I am the dining coordinator for um, the Acton uh, Senior Center. Um, uh, Minuteman Senior Services actually runs the <coughs> Meals on Wheels and the uh, dining room at and the kitchen in the Acton Senior Center. We provide Meals on Wheels for anywhere from 50 to 60 uh, consumers right now, every day, Monday through Friday. And we have a congregate lunch that we do, um, that we provide, we serve at 12 o'clock uh, on uh, uh, every day except Friday. So if you have any uh, desire to join us or to find out more information about it, um, you can contact me at um, 781-221-7098. Also, if you're getting Meals on Wheels, you would want to contact Minuteman Senior Services, which is uh, the number there is 781-221-7083. Um, they arrange for the Meals on Wheels actually in the office. Not that you can't call me, but it would be probably faster to go to them if that's what you were looking for. The congregate meals, talk to me. Hi everyone, my name is Chris Chirokas. I'm the program manager at the Council on Aging. So I plan a lot of the activities that go on here. Um, if you haven't been here before, we offer a wide variety of 
activities for seniors 60 and up. Uh, for Acton seniors, practically everything we do is free. Uh, for out of town seniors, some of our things are open to people that live out of town um, and there might be a small fee involved. Um, a big um, popular thing here is exercise classes. We have, I think, about 14 a week and Acton Nursing Service. They provide balance classes as well. Um, in addition to that, we have a gym. People can come and work out on their own. Uh, we have a lot of lifelong learning uh, programs. Right now we have an Emily Dickinson class. Um, we have special events. In October, we're having what's called a car fit event where um, a senior 16 and older um, attends and we have trained technicians look over your car, see how things like your mirrors fit with you and uh, all in the name of safe driving. Um, and it's a free event for anyone in Acton who's over 60. And we have a lot of classes. We have watercolor class, um, things like that. A lot of music programs. This fall we're starting a new classical music series and um, lifelong learning, things like that are very popular with our seniors. Um, and I'm always open to suggestions or if you want to volunteer yourself to uh, lead a group, we have different groups here. Uh, there's a genealogy group that's in need of a new leader. Uh, we have computer club and all kinds of things for people to get together and share things they're passionate about. And we have lots of games, uh, mahjong and chess and bridge are really popular and people come on a drop-in basis and play those each week. And if you ever want to reach me, my number's um, at the Council on Aging, 978-929-6652. Um, and I'm usually here Monday through Thursday all day um, and Tuesday evenings as well. So look forward to meeting you if I haven't already.